Well, someone's been busy. Well, indeed, we have been. Thank you all so much for your patience as we work through our queue and try to tackle some of these more complicated box, like the slivers. But we're finally starting to ship out a whole bunch of boxes, and there'll be more on the way. Hey, we've got a ratchet bomb update, don't we? We've got one of those, too. second sliver was made for royalty. This dark purple egg, some gold armor and purple flesh turned out great. Here's your storage to compartment for your dice. Here's where your cards will go. Hey, let me know what you think in the comments below. Sliver number three was quite a particular challenge. Uh, Adam wanted this egg to look one way in the light and another way in the dark. This is probably the most difficult uh, piece I've ever made, but I think it turned out great. With your, your dice. Here's the inside. Number three. Let's shut the lights off. Let's see what this looks like. Bam! Look at that. You charge this up with the UV light. And it is made with glow-in-the-dark resin, glow-in-the-dark powder in the uh, paint, and glow-in-the-dark play in the rooms and it just pops when you shine it up with some UV light and charge it up. Yeah, let me know what you think of this one in the comments below. Polished up all the pieces for the ratchet bomb and made sure they fit like they're supposed to so we'll be able to assemble it correctly whenever we make our first castings. But before we do that, we'll have to make a mold. And that's the next step. Then we can start making some copies. You will want to be a Patreon member. If you want to get a hold of one of these, we'll satisfy all their orders first. And after that is complete, we'll open up the Ratchet Bomb to the public. Well, the Ratchet Bomb is turning out great. I can't wait to see it complete. And this is your last chance. If you have any ideas for the next deck box, let us know. Join the discussion on Discord. See you tonight on Twitch, and as always, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.